Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I'm going to answer one of the selenium interview questions. That is, what is cucumber dry run? Let me answer. We generally perform a dry run in cucumber automation projects to see whether all the steps in all the scenarios of all the feature files of the project are implemented or not. It's just to get a confirmation. Okay. It's just to get a confirmation that all the steps in all the scenarios of the feature files are implemented. Why we have to get a confirmation? So before running, we want to cross check. Okay. Before running the all the steps in all the scenarios of the feature file, we just want to know whether all the steps in all the scenarios of the feature file are implemented or not. If any particular step is not implemented, okay, we can find it out with the help of dry run. And then we'll uh, implement that step and then we'll perform normal running. Okay. So that's what is the purpose of the dry run. Let me practically show you. So for that, I'll switch to this uh, Eclipse ID where we have this cucumber framework or project, whatever you say. Okay. Here already there are three feature files. Okay. So in this feature file, intentionally I have provided a step for which the code is not written. For example, user enters valid product HP into the search box field. Okay. If I go to the search, it's already implemented here. User enters valid product into the search box field. The, the, the particular step in this uh, scenario of the feature file is implemented here, right? But this step I intentionally added just now, okay, before I started recording of this session, I just added this step, but I have not implemented it. But this step is not intentionally implemented. There is no method associated in the step definition file of this, okay, project and all. This step is not implemented. No method or code is written for or implemented for this step. Now, let's say your project is very big and there are a lot of feature files, you don't know whether all the steps in all the feature files of all the, all the scenarios of the feature files are implemented or not. You just want to cross check. You want to do a dry run to see whether all the steps in all the scenarios of the feature file are implemented or not before going with the actual running of the scripts of this feature files and all. For that, what you do is go to the test runner. In the test runner, you just add something like this, dry run, is equal to true. Let's put a comma. Okay. The purpose of this running of this uh, feature files here is to check whether any step in any scenario of any feature file is not implemented or not. Okay. Or whether everything is implemented so that we can go further for executing of the scripts. Now, when I say dry run is equal to true, it will not run the real scripts. Rather, it will check. It will cross check whether all the steps in all the scenarios of the feature file are implemented or not. You see, within seconds, it will tell you. When I run it, within seconds, it will tell you whether all the steps, you see, whatever the steps which are coming in green color are implemented. So under login, this is implemented, these steps are implemented, these steps are implemented. Keep on scrolling down, green color means no problem. If you see anything in yellow or orange color, you see, for example, this particular step is not implemented. Okay. This step is not implemented out of all the scenarios in all the feature files. Only this particular step of this scenario of this uh, search feature file is not implemented. So what do we do? We'll go to that uh, search dot feature file and implement this particular step. For now, I'll remove this step. Right? Okay. So just for sample purpose, I provided that. Okay, now run the dry run again to see whether all the steps in all the scenarios of the, all the feature files are implemented or not. If everything comes in green, then we are good to go and run the scripts. Okay, this is what is dry run is all about. Just to cross check. Okay, you see all the steps in all the scenarios of the feature files are implemented. There is no orange uh, steps or something. That means dry run is passed. Then we can go and run the actual scripts now. Okay. Remove this dry run and run the scripts as usual. Okay. So this is what is the purpose of the dry run. Okay. What, what is uh, Cucumber dry run and what is the purpose? 
to cross check before running the actual scripts in all the scenarios of the feature files. We just do a dry run to check whether all the steps in all the scenarios of the feature file are implemented or not. If any particular step is found as unimplemented, we'll implement and uh, cross check the dry run again to see whether everything is implemented and run the scripts. Okay, that's what is dry run, nothing more than that. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye bye.